for the NBA live on 2K Sports. This is Kevin Harlan with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. David Aldridge is on our sideline. It's the Toronto Raptors taking on the Boston Celtics. Let's check out Toronto's starting lineup. They've got Bargnani, Carter out there with Bosch. And it's DeRozan, and it's Lowry in at the one. And Russell gets it to go. Just one thing else that separates Russell from other bigs. I mean, the speed to outrun most guys on the court. Now here is Carter. Back to Lowry. Outside DeRozan. Passes to Bosch. Rebounded by the Celtics. You know, I think the effort on defense there has everything to do with why he missed that shot. Well done. Here's Kuz now recovering. Garnett up top. Shoots. The top of the key jumper is on the mark. KG just looks so confident. Like the moment he had the ball, he knew that shot was dropping. And now just over a minute played here in the first. A shot by Lowry, no good. Boy, he knows he should have knocked that one down, especially with the defense not giving much of an effort. Here's Garnett. Bosch grabs the miss. And it's Lowry with the ball. Brings it up for the Toronto Raptors. Four-point game. Bargnani is screen on Burke. Lowry kicks to Carter. Pass to Bosch. Now Lowry lets it go from deep. And again, no good by Toronto. Bird, the pass to Sharman. Garnett outside. Now the pass to Bird. Bargnani grabs the board. We're just about two minutes into the first quarter. Lowry deciding where to go with it here. Wow, drew the contact in that three. Almost went in, so he'll go to the line for three free throws. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the night right now. Here, Havlicek is checked in. And he's good on the second. Here's Kuzi. Garnett outside. Stolen by Bosch. Carter looking around. And DeRozan kicks to Barnett. Carter down low. Garnett comes over to help. The wide open look here for Bosch. That one falls coming off Carter's feet. At nearly seven feet tall, Bosch brings a lot of value with his ability to shoot the jumper. Here's Kuzi. Now recovering. Kuzi passes to Russell. Bird outside. Havlicek right side. Six on the shot clock. Boston again missing. Raptors with the lead. 153 left in the first quarter of the game. And it's Carter missing. You can't look at the result of that shot. They'll take that whenever they get it. Well, you know, I hear you. That's a good look. But when you're that wide open, I think you got to knock it down. Here's the three. And that one's good from Havlicek. Tell you what, this is, you know, this is what you want from your point guard. Kuzi just knows 
when his guys are wide open. Pass to Bosch. The 11-footer, and he gets the bucket. Bosch has got five. Boy, he's really feeling it right now, shooting a high percentage to start this game. Here are the Celtics with the ball. Kicks it to Russell. Bird against Carter. Bird passes to Havlicek. And again, Boston with the triple. Yeah, we've talked about this often. Hondo does a lot of things that help you win. They're from deep range. That'll help spread the floor, too. Now here is Lowry. Dishes a two to Rosen. Out to the right wing. Here's Bargnani. He can't get that one to fall. Nice D from Russell. And so Bird will bring it up for Boston. Three-point lead. Kuzi passes to Russell. To Rosen against Havlicek. Bird left side. Over Bosch. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Russell. Well, that's a moment he'd like to archive. Embarrassing lapse of judgment there. Carter against Bird. Carter left side. At the end of one, a closely contested game so far. Austin on top, up three. And the second quarter will get underway just after this short break. And we're ready to get back into the action here in game one. Let's see what this quarter has in store for us. And the Celtics guys, what jumps out to you, stats wise? You, you got to credit their defense. Communicating, rotating, making plays on the ball. They've got them rattled. It's only the first quarter, and already they've made enough big plays on defense to last really an entire game. We've got McHale. He's out there with Pierce. And it's Cowens in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. That's the Boston Five. Five to shoot. A three from Bosch. Rebound, Boston. Here's Kuzi. Scoreless thus far. Applejack outside. And again, Boston with the triple. And you gotta love Kuzi's ability to really create opportunities for his teammates. Just a pure point guard with superior passing skills. Now here's Bosch. Five points in the game. Takes it out to Leonard from deep. Rebounded by McHale. And I thought that was going to drop. It looked good from here. Here's Havlicek. Siakam pulls it in. Raptors trail by six. Out to Stoudemire. Bosch heads the pick for Stoudemire. To the wing right side. Bosch dishes to Leonard. And he nails the jumper. Leonard's got his first basket of the night. Claw getting rid of it in a hurry. Nice quick release that time. Here's Kuzi. Headed by Stoudemire. Kuzi passes to Havlicek. That doesn't go either for Havlicek. Siakam kicks to Leonard. concentration to hit the double clutch layup. Leonard's got four points this quarter. Well, Leonard will battle you inside and his strength can get him through the opposition. The kick out to Havlicek. To the paint. Here's Cowens. That shot off. Baj with some nice D. Toronto trailing. Takes it out to Leonard. A three ball. And it's Leonard again missing. 
Here's Kuzi. Ready by Stoudemire. It's Pierce on the wing. With some arc. Good D by Siakam. Toronto with the ball. In the second quarter, they've given up just three points. This is it to Peterson. Drills it from outside. Peterson's got the lead up to one now for Toronto. Just a classic long wing. Mopi is a threat from deep. So the Celtics call timeout. They're first. They're trying to stem the tide here. Yeah, you know, they had to do something, anything to stop this run. You can't just let it go on any longer. So both teams making some changes here. and left to play here in the second quarter. Russell passes to Sharman. Back to Russell. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. You know, individually, Russell affects the game in so many ways, but as a teammate, I just think he elevates everybody else's play, makes them better. Austin shooting their first free throws of the game right now. This is the free throw. And he sinks the second. 132 left to play in the first half. Lowry against White. Lowry kicks to Carter. Pulls up. High post. And another basket for Toronto. And it just seems that every pass they make is leading to a score. Just great ball movement. To the middle. Here's Sharman. A great one-two punch. Beautiful pass and nasty jam. And those plays can make a difference in a game like this. <laughs> well, you know it's going to fire up, Greg, everybody on that bench. Making a statement for sure. I mean, we'll see if they can maintain that aggressive approach, guys. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Oh, such a crafty player. Lowry excels at using his body to draw contact. Toronto shooting their fourth and fifth attempts at the free throw line tonight. Free throw drops for Lowry. Some changes for Toronto. Marnani is checked in for Davis. And Chris Bosch is subbed in for Leonard. Second free throw. No good. Bosch lays it up off the glass. Bosch has got seven. Look, when you're defending Bosch, I think you got to get your body into him and on him. Box him out on the misses, or he'll do what he just did there. Here's Kuzi. Still without a basket. Three-pointer, Bird. DeRozan with the rebound. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. There's 25 seconds left here in the second. 
Boy, defense non-existent there, but they catch a break as he whiffs it. 15 seconds left in the first half of basketball. Here's Kuzi. DeRozan defending. Garnett with a screen on DeRozan. Three on the clock. For the three. And he was able to put it up in time, but doesn't fall. Yeah, and he plays a lot bigger than that six-foot frame would suggest. Lowry is just a bundle of energy out there. And that'll do it for the first half. A competitive game so far. It's the Raptors ending the second quarter on a 12-3 run. And we've got more NBA action on 2K Sports coming your way after this break. They've managed to keep this game very competitive. And despite the crowd's attempt to distract them, they've really stayed focused on... Looking at how the Celtics... And that concludes... And we're happy to have you back for more playoff basketball here in round one. Without question, John Havlicek displaying his skills. Yeah, he's just been raining down on him from deep here. Talk about dialed in. Well, you know, the stroke looks fantastic. Even when he's had a hand in his face, it hasn't affected him at all. Well, it doesn't get much better than playoff basketball. Let's get back to the action here in round one. So the Raptors five right now. Bosch is out there with Carter. Then there's Lowry, then it's Bargnani, and it's DeRozan in at the two guard. Now here is Carter. No good that time. Nice D from Bird. To the inside, and it's out of bounds. The Raptors will take it the other way. is leading by three. Now Carter. Bosch a screen on Burke. Here's Carter. Sinks the 15-footer. Carter's got the first basket of the second half. That one for Toronto. Oh, I like that. Good read by BC. An elite big-time scorer with versatility. Garnett outside. He dishes it to Bird. Toronto grabs the miss. Lowry with the ball. Outside DeRozan. Fades. The rebound by Garnett. Garnett's got four rebounds now tonight. Over a minute and a half into the third quarter of action. Russell passes to Kuzi. The Celtics need to get a shot off. Three-pointer, Bird. Wow, came this close to a four-point play. He'll head to the line for three free throws. You know, part of what makes Bird exceptional is his all-around talent. I mean, he gets it done on both ends of the floor, and that's how you end up being an MVP in the league. on the second free throw. Yeah. 
and he makes all three. And that's another area where he is just a superb player. Excellent at the free throw line. Now, here's DeRozan. Defense is right there. Bird pulls it in. Just one for four from the field. Not the way they wanted to start the second half. Kuzi passes it to Garnett. Over Bosch. Shots good by Garnett. Garnett's got it all tied up now for Boston. There's that silky smooth jumper of Garnett. Nice elevation. And the height of the release point makes that a reliable mid-range look. Now here is Carter. Pass to Barnett. Carter down low. The kick out to Bosch. And again, no good by Toronto. So it's Boston now. They've only allowed two points so far here in the second half. Here's Carter, and he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. A focal point of this offense, Carter knows exactly how to find ways to get himself to the line. This is his first free throw of the game. First free throw is good. When you think Vince Carter, dunking is probably the first thing that comes up. But Vince is also someone who can be a first option. Tremendously talented. Havlicek, he's checked in for Boston. The Raptors also with a sub. Stoudemire's checked in. Off on that one, so he goes one for two at the line. Yeah, disappointing not to convert all of them, but he did get the one to give them the lead. Kuzi can hit. Raptors with the lead. And the call will be against Kevin Garnett. That's his first foul. I mean, that's, it's close, but, you know, didn't get on balance quick enough. Yeah, and as quick as players are at this level, in this day and age, I mean, you've got to be perfect in your anticipation to draw the charge. Here's Stoudemire. Plays it up and in on the nice reverse. Guys, that time he went for the fancy finish for us there, man. That was sweet. Havlicek against DeRozan. Garnett with a screen on DeRozan. Now here is Havlicek. D right on him. Makes it off the glass. Just a relentless machine. Never seems to fatigue. Havlicek, once he gets loose inside, it's tough to keep him from hurting. Now here is Carter. Five points in the game. DeRozan scanning the floor. Five on the clock. The three from Bosch. The long distance three is Barry. Bosch has got ten. I, I love his shot selection today. He set the bar for the rest of the team. Bosch against Garnett. The pass to Kuzi. And Garnett has it in the corner. This ball movement by Boston. Havlicek. That's good. And so Garnett with the assist. Havlicek's got five points now this quarter. There's 37 seconds left in the third quarter of the game. DeRozan finds Carter. And they pick up two. Carter's got his third basket of the night right there. DeRozan putting on a passing clinic. Great vision. Here's Kuzi. Still scoreless. And it's Havlicek missing. And no need to rush this. Let the clock run down. Yeah, don't give them another possession here. Carter against Bird. Back to Stoudemire. From past the arc. Oh, good on that one. And we just finished the third quarter, and we've got a tight ball game here. Raptors lead by three. And when we return, we'll get the fourth quarter rolling right here on 2K Sports.
And we're with you again as our round one coverage continues. Celtics trail by three. Here's out there with Kevin McHale. Then it's Russell. Then there's Havlicek. That's the Boston Five. To tie it up. Hits it from three-point range. Havlicek's got the fourth quarter started here with a bucket for Boston. And he's on his way to putting up a big three-point total. And so Lowry will bring it up for the Toronto Raptors. Pass to Davis. Back to Lowry. And it's Sherman with the rebound. And here's Boston. Outside, Russell. Havlicek outside. And trying for the go-ahead basket. It doesn't go in. Lowry against Russell. Davis with a screen on Russell. Here's Lowry. And it's sent back by Russell. Great timing there. Outstanding instincts by Bill Russell. In the long, long reach, it's a wrap. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. Here's Sharman. After the made shot from Kyle Lowry, that puts them in the lead. Havlicek's got 20. Yeah, a tremendous effort from Havlicek here tonight scoring the ball. Toronto trail. Outside Lowry. Siakam kicks to Lowry. And Boston with the rebound. Russell's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. He's certainly been cold this quarter, guys, but trying to shoot his way back into a groove. Havlicek dishes to Pierce. Pass to Sharman. Russell is screen on DeRozan. Shot clock at six. And Bill Russell slams it in. And remember, Havlicek was a highly recruited quarterback, so you see his passing ability on that one. Toronto calls timeout. Without question, John Havlicek displaying his skills. He's on another level right now. Knocking down threes left and right. The defense isn't doing their job, and I think they've got to talk about it quickly. Some changes for Toronto. Marnani has checked in for Davis. Bosch comes in for Pascal Siakam. And it's Carter in for Leonard. Time now to turn to our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David. Thanks, Kevin. Well, Toronto's head coach had some words for his team during the break. He knows they struggled at the free throw line, but he actually looked at the positive. He said, if we continue to get to the foul line, good things are going to happen. But we have to keep getting there. Maybe that'll take the heat off in the way. Okay, David, much appreciated. Celtics leading by three. Here's Kuzi. Outside, Russell. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. Andre Bargnani picks one up. And guys, what do you think about the offensive approach so far that we've seen for Boston? The three-pointers and how well they're able to shoot them. You wonder if they can keep it up, and boy, have they. And the thing I've seen that I've really been impressed by is they've gotten everybody involved. Unselfishly making that extra pass, getting that ball to the right guy at the right time for the good shot. First one falls for him. And so Russell hits them both. Raptors trail by five. Inside, here's Carter, and Vince Carter with the slam. There's no denying it. Carter is a guy you can trust to get it done in the biggest moment. Finds an angle of attack and goes right to it. Now, here is Russell. Pass to Sharman. We've got 148 left in the fourth quarter. Screened by Russell. Four on the shot clock. 
Sharman gets the bucket. Boy, at the offensive end, his game is so impressive. I mean, he's a threat every time up the floor. Carter against Bird. Arnani is screen on Bird. Down low. Second chance effort. It'll go. The Boston lead is cut down now to just three on the bucket from Bargnani. Second chance points always hurt. Just not enough effort to block out. Hey, guy standing around spectating. I mean, you got to get in there and get tough. We got exactly what we expected. Bird doing what he does in the clutch. Cold blood. Bird against Carter. There is a minute left in the fourth quarter. It counts! And he has brought them to within two points. Oh, you just love seeing a player with absolutely no fear. Cool, calm, collected, and confident in the biggest moment of the game? Yes. To tie it up, it falls! And tie game, that is a huge basket right there. And it's frightening when Bosch starts to heat up like this. Now a timeout called by Boston. It's tied at 40. There's 42 seconds left in the fourth. Here's Kuzi. There's 31 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Bird able to power through that defense despite the contact. I thought his length helped him out there. Good bird. Those were pressure pack free throws. And he looked as cool as he could be. So big to give them that three point lead. Toronto calls timeout. They trail by three. We've got 28 seconds left in the fourth quarter. And here's Carter. The dish to Lowry. Good! And oh, that was an enormous three-pointer. Lowry is small in size, but big in might. And when he gets going, he can be an offensive four. Timeout called the Celtics. Here's Kuzi, now recovering. To the inside. Here's Bird. Missed! And that's going to do it for regulation. So we are headed to overtime. We'll get right back to the action when we return. We get set for overtime in what has been a stirring contest.
Now here is Lowry. Garnett out there with Russell. And it's Bird. And it's Kuzi in at the point. The shot by Carter. Nobody around. Sinks it. What range from outside. Wow. Yeah, they're getting a lot of their points outside the paint. Three of their last five baskets are from three-point range. Here's Sharman. And he can't answer back. The three-pointer offline. Raptors leading by three. Fires from 18. Vince Carter the bucket on the assist by Lowe. Now that's 17 points for Vince Carter. Bird against Carter. And Bargnani sends it back. DeRozan passes to Lowry. And one action in this one. We're about one minute into overtime. Outside Carter. And again, Toronto with the triple. And creating a little separation here. Gaining some confidence. Yeah, you get the sense that they're going to start stretching this lead out a little bit. Here's Kuzma. Here's Sharman. Boston. No good that time either. Definitely a situation you want to make sure you don't give him too good of a look. Bosch heads the pick for Lowry. And again, Toronto with the triple. And they are starting to pull away here as the shots continue to fall. Yeah, I agree with you. A big run taking place right now. And it looks to be the beginning of the end. About 90 seconds off the clock here in the extra period. Kuzi, good, and the assist goes to Russell. Kuzi's got his first points in this one. And with that one, it ends an 11 0 run by Toronto. Bargnani is screen on Burke. Carter with it. He's picked up by Russell. And Bargnani throws it down. And he's a skilled and willing passer. Vince gets to his teammates on time and on target. Pulls it from 20. Here's Russell. And he banks in the lane. His hard work on the backboard really just has given them more opportunities to score. And it's Lowry with the ball. Brings it up for Toronto. Carter outside. He kicks it to Bargnani. Outside Lowry. Just five on the clock. A nice shot by Carter. And it's just competing. You know, giving your best when it matters most. Yeah, you know, once they got victory in their view, a huge injection of energy and a great run to finish it off. Austin with the ball. Vince Carter getting it to go from deep. Here's Russell. And the slam dunk by Russell. <laughs> it's always great to get into a rhythm, but do it when it matters. Now they're playing with urgency, huh? They could have done it much earlier before the game was out of reach. Now here is Lowry. And there's the pass to Bargnani. No good from outside. And guys, overtime not nearly as competitive as regulation. They've used up all their energy just getting it to overtime. They've been a totally different squad here in the overtime. I'm just not seeing the same energy. And they're going to move on to the conference semifinals. A big playoff win for them. But what isn't a great big in the postseason? <laughs> yeah, huh? Great point. I, I really just love.